Alright guys, so I've been grinding non-stop, not necessarily for the XP, but for uh, Miri's report. Man, it took a while to get to this point, but we're finally here guys. This is the video in which we are going to experience Miri's final companion quest and ultimately get her into the guild hall as a furnishing, right? Or a visitor or something like that. I'm not, I don't remember exactly what it's called, but... A guest for my house basically I'm pretty excited to finally get her alongside with my other companion Bastion who is finally maxed out with absolutely everything still working on Miri to be honest I haven't really been grinding XP just mainly rapport and a little bit of XP here and there but mostly rapport so unfortunately I haven't really been making some major strides on her just yet but as soon as we're done here that's all I have left is basically just grind her out and you know, max out our weapons and our guilds and all that stuff and we should be good to go. But as for this video, I'm very excited to get started on Miri's final companion quest. If you are to do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, enough yapping. Let's jump into this quest. Alright, so what do you have for me, Miri? I have another favor to ask, if it's not too much trouble. Uh, what's the favor? Mom will try her best to put her search for that puzzle box behind her, but I know her. The moment she catches wind of another flimsy lead, she'll be off looking just one more time. She's only going to stop when it's found, or she's dead. You want to scratch, uh, you want to search for it, don't you? That, that's actually pretty sweet. Want to? No. Need to. Never mind. Probably. <laughs> My mom's been trying to fulfill her filial duty since she buried my grandfather. I'd rather not come by it the same way. I was thinking I'd pay the old mer a visit at our ancestral tomb. Will you join me? No, of course. What kind of question is that? You're like a dear friend of mine, Miri. I'll help however I can. My grandfather should be interred in our family tomb in Othrenus. At least, I think that's what mom said. She's never taken me to see him. I don't think she's been back there since the day he was buried. She doesn't want to face him empty-handed. How's visiting his grave going to help us? Well, I'm not just thinking of finally paying my respects. I can summon his ancestor spirit to the tomb. I'm hoping my grandfather can tell us something about his missing puzzle box that will help put this fetching fetcher fly hunt to rest. Wouldn't your mother have uh, already explored that option? Like I said. I don't think she's spoken with him since he died. Hmm. Mom never talks about my grandfather. I get the impression that they weren't close. Why is she going through such a uh, such great lengths to find it for him then? He was obsessed with that puzzle box. When it was stolen, getting it back was all he could think about. I don't think Mom gives two swits about the box. She just wants him to acknowledge her. Maybe I can convince him to free her from her duty. All right. Well, we'll go speak with your grandfather then. Athrenus is in Stone Falls. I can't speak for the condition of the tomb, so we should assume it's dangerous. Good to know. So, this is... Where is this quest at? It's here in Stone Falls. Oh yeah, I'm not in Stone Falls. I'm nowhere near Stone Falls. I'm on the opposite side. So, little disclosure guys, I've actually been having... <coughs> I've been having some weird connectivity issues with this game. It keeps... I've had it all day for some reason and it keeps like logging me out. And it's saying that I have like a bad internet connection, right? But I check my internet speed uh, both up and down and connectivity and stability and it's all fine. It's more than fine. It's remarkable. But for some reason the game's messing up. You light the candles, I'll mutter the ancestor summons prayer. Okay. Sounds good, Miri. So, candles. I'm gonna have to kill that thing, aren't I? We'll do, Miri. Just give me one second. I have to kill this before it gets in the way. Oh, I'm pretty sure this guy's doing the same quest. Alright. Let's light the candles. <clears throat> Grandfather. House of my house. Blood of my blood. The daughter of your daughter summons you. 
Come forth and share your wisdom. Daughter of my daughter? Ah, strangers both. Hmm. I have nothing to say to the likes of you. This is going to be complicated if I'm going to be hearing that guy's quest too. My daughter leaves me to rot for decades, and this is how I'm greeted? Roused from a neglected grave by a stranger who happens to share my blood and a filthy noir? Uh, Miri is your granddaughter, by the way. She wants to find your puzzle box. Is that what Irene has been doing all these years? Yes. Raising this whelp in the lap of luxury with that spineless Lalu boy while I molder in an early grave. Such a gratitude. So, Irene gave up searching for your puzzle box, but Miri wants to take over her uh, take over her mother's duty. Then perhaps this child is less a fool and ingrate than my own. No doubt you've been told I died in pursuit of my stolen puzzle box, but that is not the whole story. I was murdered. What? I came too close to the truth, and I was silenced for it. What do you mean? I was betrayed by one whom I called friend. We whiled away many nights, unlocking the secrets of that dwarven puzzle. But on the cusp of the solution, it vanished from my collection. When I came too close to the truth, my friend killed me. So who's your friend and specifically who did this to you? Onimeril was the Myrrh who wronged me. A guild mage of Vocal Guard. A silver-tongued liar who cheated me out of my dearest possession and my life. Return what's mine. Bring me the puzzle box and Irene's failings will be forgiven. Why don't you... Uh, tell this to Irene. Because she is a disappointment, as she has always been. Wow. Sweet. A Dunmer with her upbringing should have paid her respects to me a hundred times over. Her contempt for tradition is a blight on our house. It sounds like you two, uh, two weren't even close. Fair close. We are family. Close has nothing to do with it. She was born and raised to carry on the legacy of our house. It was her duty to bring prestige and prosperity to our name as we have for generations, not run off with some feckless Lalu. So, I take it you didn't approve of her marriage? Of course not. She was intended to be betrothed to the house father's firstborn, not some tenth rate house cousin she'd fetched trinkets for. With a word, she could have elevated our station to the great houses. I ask so little, and she delivers less. Why is this puzzle so important to you anyways? It was a singular find. The greatest in my career. A Dwemer puzzle box of such complexity and beauty that it could only truly be appreciated by a great mind. Onimeril understood that. We knew that this device hid answers to mysteries only they knew. Worth dying over? Worth killing over, at least. I Clearly. underestimated Onimeril's ambitions. I didn't think High Elves had the stomach for theft and murder. I should never have shared that box with anyone. It was meant for me and me alone. Are you certain that o o that man uh, was behind all of this? <clears throat> he was behind me at every turn, studying the puzzle box, commiserating its loss, guiding me in searching for he was clever enough to keep my attention focused outward. Staying in my blind spot until the very moment he pushed me to my death. What makes you think he still has the puzzle box? Anyone who knew that device's <clears throat> true value would never let it go. He'd never part with it willingly, no matter how much its maddening design might thwart him. My only consolation is my certainty that the puzzle has tormented him ever since he stole it. Okay, goodbye. I have a strange feeling there's going to be some sort of a plot twist coming. What an ass. I can see why mom wasn't keen to visit all these years. I can't believe she spent so many years trying to please that fetcher. A lot of people try to pe uh, please their parents. Don't I know. I suppose I should be more grateful to mom and dad for letting me be my own person. I had no idea. If my father talked to me that way, I'd have pushed him off a ledge myself. <laughs> Miri, relax, alright? 
You still want to help find this puzzle box? Only so I could shove it up his ashes. <laughs> this is important to my mother. I'm doing this for her, not that old sweat. Let's head to Volkhel Guard. See if we can find this onimeral. I may want to shake his hand. Damn. That got dark quick. Uh, <laughs> very well. Let's go to Vol uh, Volkhel... That place guard. My grandfather said Onimeral was a guild mage from Volkhel Guard. Maybe we'll find him there. Or at least find someone who knows where he is. Will do. Man, Miri... <laughs> uh, Miri is hilarious. Hold up, let me check. So now we're going Volkhel... So now we gotta go to... Oh my god. So where was this? Okay, it's all over here on the other side. Wait, where was it? I already forgot where it was. Oh god, okay. Well, when I get to the... Way Shrine, I need to look up where exactly this is. Okay, so I'm back at the Way Shrine. It is in Alderaan. Okay, let's go. Okay, so where exactly? It's down there. This is... Actually, there's one right here. This is probably the closest one, clearly. So let's go ahead and see what this person that Miri wants to shake hands with is uh this way let's go Miri nope not no I'm not talking to you I'm on a mission thank you bye all right where is this place so it's at the mages guild it appears so excuse me oh Nimrod's departure is no excuse you two are mages of the guild first. I expect to see you both in my office shortly. Okay. Oh dear. This one is in trouble now. Okay. Takanano. Takano. You, Tat. Oh, Takano will get in trouble. Now that Kalia is keeping an eye on things. I thought I heard you mention a Master Onimaril? I'm actually kind of looking for him. Can you point me in the right direction? Ah, yes. Takano is... Uh, was one of Onimaril's apprentices before he was um, kicked out of the guild. It has left this one in a rather precarious predicament. Perhaps we could help one another? How so? Well, you see... As Onimaril's apprentice, this one was afforded certain privileges. His master was not so particular about the uh, rules of the guild, so his banishment was not all that surprising. But his replacement is quite stern, and this one has erred. What are you? What exactly are you asking? This one might have. Turned on Nimaril's other apprentice are let into a chicken. She <laughs> has run off, and should his new master discover Takano's error, he is certain to be expelled. If you return or be found, Arlet, he will tell you of Onimaril. Okay, very well. I'll find this chicken for you. This one fears <laughs> Arlet will be tempted by the grains near the Salted Wings Tavern and wind up someone's dinner. Please find her quickly. She had lustrous blue-green feathers. Agano is certain she will stand out, for better or worse. Can you undo the transformation? <laughs> this one certainly hopes to get the opportunity to try, but... Uh... That will not matter if Arlette is feathered and fried. <clears throat> that That's true. We'll read up on transformations while you search. Just please find her. Why don't you go after Arlette yourself? Nimaril's <clears throat> former apprentices are on probation, and his new instructor watches us like a hawk. It is only by some miracle that she did not witness Takano's terrible error. She will discover it if Arlet does not return soon. Okay, good to know. So we gotta find a chicken. Is it here in this location? It is. Okay, so luckily we don't have to go very far. Yep, whatever you say, kitty. Okay, so it's gotta be... Oh, found the chicken! 
That was easy. No, oh man, now I gotta chase him. This is not even a chicken, it's like a rooster. These are chickens. Where are you going? Come here. Got him. Or her. I hope this is the right one, or it's going to make for an interesting scene back at the guild. That's true. The Takanano or whatever his name was, he should have came with us. Because he's the one that definitively knows which chicken it is. I don't. I'm just going by what he said. And chickens, to a normal human being that has nothing to do with chickens, sees chickens as they're all the same. So, there's I that. I don't know why anyone would eat chicken when they could have a plump pony gua. Well, whatever you say there, Miri. You're back, and you come bearing fowl. Oh, yes, that looks to be our left. He can see the profound sadness in her eyes. <laughs> More judgment, but either is a good sign. Such a relief. This one was shedding most profusely from nerves. We found our net for you. Now help us with our nil. Oh, of course, of course. Onimaril was expelled from the guild not long ago, as you know. But he did not call the guild hall his home. He was very secretive and kept to a small wilderness retreat northwest of Skywatch. Takano was never invited to it. Okay. Well, either way, thank you for the information. Uh, not to speak <clears throat> ill of his former master, but Takano thinks you should know that Onimaril was expelled from the guild for dabbling in forbidden magic. This one never saw it for himself. His master was always kind to him. But if true, be careful. Yeah, we'll be careful. Uh, forbidden magic in the Mages Guild. I mean, the only thing I can think of is... Oh, I missed it. I wanted to see the transformation. Uh, I'm assuming he was dabbling in necromancy. Okay, so it's still here in Ardon. That's a good thing. So we have to go to the Quintinimium Way Shrine. So let's go to the other Way Shrine here. So we can travel for free, basically. This is honestly a beautiful zone, I think. What's you guys' favorite zone in the game? I, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like uh, Glenumbra. Okay, so let's go here. It should be just a straight shot. Except for, of course, the mountains in the way. I should have saw that coming, to be honest. All right. Actually, it might actually be somewhat of a straight shot. Okay, yeah, it doesn't seem to be very difficult to get here, so that's a good thing. Onimaril, I'm coming! Find Onimaril's retreat. Well, that was easy. Let's see if Onimaril left anything helpful behind. Agreed! Uh, is that a treasure trove? Yeah, it is. Let me see. Okay, so I hate reading, so bear with me, guys. I swear that Devious Collector is thwar thwarting me from his grave. It's been decades and his angry eyes still glare at me in his dreams, red and full of spite. It was worth it. For the secrets of the puzzle, uh, the ear one, ear of one dark elf is a small price to pay. A small price. I've hired five reasonably talented mages no longer affiliated with the smug uh, lot in the mages guild. Disaffected and discreet, they don't know I was expelled. As if I needed the rigid minds of those laboring under Vanis Galarian's thumb. That's the founder of the Mages Guild who came from the Sigic Order. Uh, as you guys know from the main storyline. Uh, they think his experiment may prove them with uh, re-entry into the guild. I finally found a Dwemer site. With the proper alignment I will require. Pity it it's in the rift. Oh man, we're gonna have to go to the rift now. I just like the uh, burly Nords in their bellicose ways. Still, 
shirt remains uninhibited by laws or other riffraff. I'm sure I can deal uh, with a few of the and and that word soon. <laughs> soon uh, I will know what the dwarves hid within uh, within this cryptic device, and their knowledge will set me head and shoulders above others, Vanus especially. What went wrong? Why? This, uh, it, it was the fools I hired. It had to be. Pity they died. Died? Whoa. Or I would strip their minds of all reason for botching this so. Fools, I barely made it out. I must get back there. Try again. I must get it back. I must try again. A short rest first. To plan, I must have it back. Red Eyes, uh, smiling in the dark. He did this. Him. You can't keep it from me. I will recover the treasure and its secrets. Okay, so not only is he cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, but uh, he got people killed. Looks like trying to solve that puzzle box took its toll on Onimeral. Why were he and my grandfather so enamored with this thing? Well, Onimeral seems to think it's connected to the uh, that in the rift. I get that, but I also get the impression that a Nimeral's finding the answers he wants to find. Sometimes a riddle is just a riddle. At least his destination was clear enough. Hopefully the box is still in that dwarven ruin. You think the box is just a toy? I don't know. It's not like I've ever laid eyes on the thing. I just don't see how some hunk of dwarven junk can be worth everything these two have sacrificed. If we do find it and I start going crazy, do me a favor and smash the fetching thing. Okay, good to know. So now we gotta go to the rift, right? Yes, we do. And I don't feel like running back to the thing, so I'm just gonna fast travel straight there. Wait. That's a Nimeril. Oh, I totally forgot. I had replaced my... My skill. Okay, well he's dead. Now to the rift. Yeah, I don't feel like running back to the way shrine, so I'm just gonna fast travel there. It's probably the best way to get there. I'm actually kind of surprised we killed Onimaril so quickly. Like, randomly I, I should say. Wasn't expecting to, to have to murder the man. But it is what it is. Excuse me. Excuse me, I need to get through. OMG. Okay, I probably should have my horse. I'm not gonna lie, like, this is not a bad quest, but I kinda like Bastion's quest a lot more. Uh, also, I need to find a way in. Well, okay, I need to go all the way around then. Because this is clearly not the right way. Okay, I found it! <laughs> that was easy enough. Whoops, that was an accident. I hope you're ready, Miri. It's about to go down. In the burning ring of fire. Hold on. Oh, well. I was going to change my skill, but I totally forgot yet again. You come, you come, you come. Oh my god, how many of you guys need to come out of this hole? Okay, before I forget, weapon, sword and shield. Okay, also, let's go ahead and check which way is probably best. It's probably best to go this way, huh? Seems to be the faster way. Nice try there, bud. Miri, you're doing excellent, by the way. Hello. Man, there's so many coming out of this thing, it's insane. Luckily, they're not very tough. 
Is it? No, it's not that way. So I gotta go this way now. Run away. Well, now I guess we Maybe they should try that. All right, time to get down. Give me some stamina back. Dunzo. And uh, I guess we still have some more combat to do. We shouldn't be too far either. It's literally right around the corner, so we're golden. I don't have that, and I want it. So, we're going to play the what am I going to draw next game. Bingo. Excuse me. Whoa, that was a weird stutter there. See you later, buddy. Yeah, we're right around the corner. Don't fight me. Something hey. tells me your Nimeral's theory didn't pan out. Maybe be gentle with that box. This is the box, and this is the dead people that we read about. Well, this is interesting. Feeling all right? No all-consuming desire to solve the unknowable mystery? Great. Let's get out of here. Okay, I'm down. Luckily, we already killed half the, are the the area, so should be just a straight shot up out of here. And I guess not. Everyone already respawned, unfortunately. Get out of my way, you dwarven sphere. Oh, thank you for killing everyone. Is this the exit? Is it the exit? Oh, it's this way. I was confused for a second. It says, talk to Miri outside of this place. So luckily, that we didn't have to spend too much time Unnecessary time in this place. All right, Mary, what do we got going on? I can't say I understand what all the fuss was about. It's a box, a fancy box, but a box nonetheless. Hard to imagine that this piece of fetching garbage has caused my family so much anguish. I'll be happy to bury it. So what do we do next then? I'll send word to my mother to meet us in Athrenis. We will deliver it to my family's plot, and hopefully she'll find some closure with my bull netch of a grandfather. Do you think they'll reconcile? <clears throat> my granddad doesn't deserve mom's devotion, or forgiveness. But if it frees her of her guilt and obligations, she'll be safe and I'll be happy. Come on, let's not tempt fate by lingering with that thing. Mary is super sweet, man. Alright, so the next hit spot is in Ebonheart. Or not Ember Heart in Stone Falls. Screw it. I don't feel like running to the to the next to uh, the closest way shrine, so we're fast traveling. Stone Falls. This is a pretty quick quest because it feels like we're already at the end since we already got the Dwarven Sphere. There was another weird stutter there, man. The game doesn't act up like this to me. It, there's some weird Thing. I think after I'm done recording this video, I'm probably going to see if I can repair the game because the game's been acting very bad today. And I'm not, I, it's, it's pretty bad. Oh, is this her? Really? Yeah, it is. Is that you? It had better not be another skeleton. I kind of want to wait for these guys to get out of here. Okay, never mind. All right, let's go ahead and do this then. See what happens. Father. You finally did your duty. Or rather, your daughter and some moi did. Success, once removed, is so very like you. All you've ever cared about was what I could do for you. Well, this is the last favor. That goes for us as well. You've set a poor example for your daughter, always putting your whims before the good of the house. You can stuff the fetching house. Our <laughs> family is more than just your legacy. Come Agreed. On, We're wasting our breath. 
Good for you, Miri, for sticking up for your mom. You're not even looking in the right direction. Alright. You. Well, Outlander, at least you understand the value of doing what you're told. I mean, in some situations it's appropriate, right? But most situations you gotta be your own person and stand on your own two feet. Uh, you don't seem very appreciative of that of the effort. Does the house father heap gratitude upon his vassals for paying tributes left long overdue? I have been wrong. My forgiveness will not come so cheaply. Talk about being ungrateful. So you won't even try to reconcile? I will not be lectured on the matters of my house by some uppity noir. Oh, fine. I will be the bigger man. Let it not be said that I was never magnanimous. This dude's kind of an ass. Hey, Mary. Damn, ancestors. If they want to make such a big deal of us paying our respects, they can put more effort into paying them back. He certainly knows how to hold a grudge, that's for sure. Huh. Grudges and curses are done merry traditions dating back to the anticipations. Just because they're old doesn't make them good. I'm happy to leave all that to rot with Grandad and his stupid gold brick. But it looks like Mom is willing to forgive. You think your mother will be content with how things turned out? She has nothing to regret. She did everything she could. That damn box was the last excuse that could be made for why they were estranged. They still can't make up after this. Grandad's just a fetching arsehole. Either way, she'll be fine. Yeah, I mean, I agree, but not necessarily with an ash hole. Replace the first H with another S, and then we'll agree. Do you want some time with her, by the way? No. We should give her and Grandad some space. They have a lot to catch up on, assuming they don't just start cursing each other out. We've done our part. Let's get back to saving the world. Or whatever. Will do. And we get Mirian Elendis as a furniture... <laughs> Uh, the interpret <laughs> sounds dumb. I don't know why. The interpret uh explorer Mary Elendis needs a break from her inksome family. With thrilling tales and uh and a sailor's mouth, she's sure she's sure to impress. After aiding Mary in your home, after adding Mary in your uh, to your home, you can set her on a path. Plus, you and your visitors can speak with her. Okay. Good to know. If you keep helping us out like this, Mom's liable to adopt you. For which, I apologize ahead of time. I mean, I'm not trying to get adopted there, Miri, but... I, I mean, I guess I appreciate the gesture. But... Yeah, I don't I don't really want to be adopted. I'm, I'm very comfortable and content of being my own man. But right now, though, I do kind of want to go back to the house and place her right next to Bastion and see how it all, like how it looks having them, you know, side by side together. I don't know. I'm pretty stoked, to be honest, to have Miri at the house. So let's go ahead and go. And I got some rapport. How much rapport was that anyways? 500 for completing her quest. That was a lot. Okay, so let's go back to the house. Or the guild hall. And see. Or not necessarily see, but like place her down and see what happens. Nothing really spectacular happened when I placed Bastion down. But regardless, I still wanna still wanna put it down, you know? So let's go ahead and go into F5. We're gonna have to replace somebody. I already know exactly who I'm gonna replace. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this person right here. Uh, put away. Browse. Let's put companions. Uh, Miri. What's on the docket? You can stand right next to Bastion. Right there. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to her. Good talk. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. I sometimes wonder what it must be like for Daedra. 
going through their lives with no real sense of time passing them by, where loss and death are annoying trivialities. No wonder they feel powerful and hollow. I really like this outfit for her, by the way. What? Rude. How did you ever get through these long periods of quiet without me? I don't know. Good question. Let's try one more. I've had so many near-death experiences since I met you. I really need to go make an offering to the three before they think me ungrateful. Okay, whatever you say. Look how beautiful this looks, by the way. Both Miri and Bastion are just chilling at my house, man. I'm glad you guys are here, man. I really am. But that's basically going to do it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed this series, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. As far as this quest line goes, I did like it. I did actually enjoy it. I just thought it was kind of basic, to be honest. I think there was more complexity with Bastion's character building that made me enjoy Bastion's quest line more. Not to say that Miri's quest line wasn't complex. There was some dynamic, you know, resolutions that had to be done, essentially, but it, it, it overall was kind of cliche, you know what I mean? And I don't know, because of that, I kind of feel like it was not a bad quest, but it wasn't a good quest either. It was just kind of there, right? And yeah, there's that. I, I really enjoyed Bastion's quest line though a lot more. So I don't know. I kind of can't wait to have more companions because I really want to go through that experience all over again because the companions, you know, they're with you and they share you know, a part of your story when they're coming around with you and traveling with you. So I love doing companion quest lines, which is why I decided to make these two little series, one for Bastion and one for Miri. So yeah, there's that. But again, I'll say it again. If you guys enjoyed this series, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.